a first step right click on snap go to settings and change this to isometric snap and click okay now our cursor is in incline mode so it will draw only isometric lines left and right plane 30 30 degree incline and top plane in this three plane it will draw the lines now in isometric we don't do any uh, dimensioning for some of the areas will require construction line so we will simply load one construction line if you want to name it you name it otherwise if you don't want you can simply create one layer and change the color of the line and from here select that now in the first drawing everyone see the drawing which i sent in front view on right hand side bottom corner o is mentioned that means that is the origin <coughs> so in front view from o we have the side on the left side that means on the left hand side we are getting front view agar iska side view rahega to wo sirf left hand right hand side view rahega okay from origin we have age or length on the left hand side that is why we are getting front view on left hand side and because of this we will get right hand side view for top view also at the bottom right corner o is mentioned so accordingly we will get top view so you will have to take care of this thing then only you can get the exact drawing if you will shift origin from anywhere then it will be problem for everyone Here 30, 90 plus 30, 120. We are getting. So this is our maximum length. In front view, we are getting the height. So maximum height is 50. In top view, we are getting length and width. So width is 60. So with this dimension, we will make one box. Excuse me, one minute. Ah, sir. Everyone. So this is length. 120. This is width 60, and this is height 50. So with these three dimensions, I have drawn this box. When we are drawing this box, if you will have to change the plane, might be sir had already told you about this. But if you will have to change the plane, if we are on right plane, if you want, if you want to draw on left plane or top plane, then simply press F5. No need of coming out of any command. Continuous lines you can draw to complete this box. one or two lines will left only okay so the benefit of this isometric is it takes very less time easy to draw no need of any dimensioning so i will prefer or i will tell you to practice more on isometric so that at least you can pass your uh, i2 and your <coughs> final practical examination if you will draw at least this isometric so i have made this block now this is the maximum dimension so the drawing will lie within this block only now take the outline or the zero line take the line now from this corner corner this is the origin so from this corner length is starting this corner is shown as in top view as origin so ye top view ka origin hai ye यहाँ से जो दिख रहा है ये फ्रंट व्यू का ओरिजिन है जब ऊपर से देखते हैं तो ये कॉर्नर और ये कॉर्नर को इनसाइड हो गया इसीलिए ये भी टॉप व्यू का ओरिजिन है फ्रॉम हियर विल स्टार्ट ऑन दिस साइड नाउ यू कैन सी दैट आई एम नॉट एबल टू ड्रॉ द लाइन ऑन लेफ्ट प्लेन सो सिंपली आई विल प्रेस एफ फाइव सो दैट आई कैन ड्रॉ द लाइन हियर सो द लेंथ मेन्शन इज नाइनटी सो आई विल मार्क नाइनटी हियर प्रेस एस कैप बिकॉज नो अदर लाइन और नो वर्टिकल लाइन इज देयर सो सिंपली प्रेस एस कैप now if we will see the front view here we are observing the straight line on this side and on this side but when we will see its top view we are getting a curved surface at this side that means we will have to make one curved surface or the semi circle on this side so 
the semi circle you can see is from the midpoint so we will find the midpoint of this by the construction line so this is the midpoint of this side now here we will find the midpoint here midpoint is not mentioned the radius is giving us the center so radius is 30 so from this corner i have marked 30 place f5 and draw the line here so this is the center at this center we will have to draw the semi circle now again i will take the line for bottom surface also i will find the center because there also i will require it little bit part of this semi circle will be visible in top view, uh, bottom plane also so that also we will have to draw now for drawing iso circle the circle in the isometric is called as iso circle for drawing iso circle we will have to use this ellipse command if you are using autocad 2007 in ellipse command you will get this iso circle if you are get using higher version of autocad in the circle command only you will directly get the option for iso circle or in the circle command you will be having option for ellipse if you will select that option for ellipse then it will ask same as here that you want to draw use arc center or iso circle so simply write i press enter then it is asking to select the center so select this center now you can see that it is drawing on top plane only if someone is not getting it on top plane if kisi ka aisa aa raha ho agar ya kisi ka aisa aa raha ho to keep pressing f5 by the time you don't get this on top plane now simply specify the radius 30 and you will get this circle now no need of redrawing this circle on bottom plane you simply copy this here okay in this it is easy to draw the circle again but in some of the drawing it is difficult to draw it again so better practice copy in other drawing also you can directly copy this thing so you have to select copy command from modify toolbar select this circle or whatever which you have to copy select that multiple objects if you want to copy then you can select multiple objects here we have got a copy of this circle only so simply select the circle press enter now it is asking for base point or displacement we are not specifying the displacement from this center we are moving it so in this way we can move now you can see that it is moving in top plane only but we want a parallel circle on bottom plane so simply press f5 it will move in the bottom plane now when it will show this midpoint simply click now you are getting the copy of this have you all understood this copy thing please message in the chat box okay okay now as it is looking like a straight line and as we had studied in projection of solids also that in cylinder or any circular object when we see from the front view it is looking like a straight edge bahut sari generators ho sakti hai lekin end generator hame dikhti hai command select karna hai line ka iske baad hi jab quadrant show karta hai aapko wahan click karna hai aur niche mein fir se jab quadrant se show karega tab click karna hai aur escape press karna hai Okay, randomly you can't draw the drawing line when it is showing quadrant. Then only you have to click. Understood? Now extra circle we will trim. So select trim command. We want circle between this and this. पीछे तक कुछ नहीं दिखेगा. so select this as one boundary and this as one boundary press enter and select the circle it will trim the remaining circle in this way message in the chat box if you have any doubt in trimming okay Okay, once again, we want circle between this line and this line because this is the behind portion which will not be visible, and here also we have this horizontal edge. 
तो ना ये सर्कल यहाँ से यहाँ तक का पूरा नहीं दिखेगा सिर्फ ये एक्सटर्नल पार्ट है ये दिखेगा तो वेल सिलेक्ट फ्रेम कमांड एंड वे विल सिलेक्ट वन बाउंड्री एंड टू बाउंड्री नो नीड ऑफ प्रेसिंग शिफ्ट और कंट्रोल और एनीथिंग फॉर मल्टीपल बाउंड्रीज ओके मल्टीपल बाउंड्रीज यू कैन कीप सिलेक्टिंग सिंपली बाय अ सिंगल क्लिक ये दोनों को सिलेक्ट किया बाउंड्री को फिर एंटर प्रेस करना है और उसके बाद जो ट्रेम करना है उसको सिंपली सिलेक्ट करके ट्रेम करना है इस तरीके से सेम वे एट द टॉप पोर्शन ऑल्सो वी हैव सेमी सर्कल ओनली सो वी विल सिलेक्ट दिस एज अवर बाउंड्री प्रेस एंटर एंड सिलेक्ट दिस सर्कल इन दिस वे नाउ हियर दिस लाइन इज थर्टी एंटर This is thirty. Enter. Then sixteen. Enter, and then we we'll join it again. So in this way we are getting. Now these two corners are joined here as an inclined surface. So for that, here the height is mentioned up to the height of ten only. We have to join this. So select line command और थो ऑफ करो या तो पोलर ऑन कर लो देन सिलेक्ट दिस कॉर्नर ज्वाइन दिस कॉर्नर विद दिस कॉर्नर वेन एवर वी विल हैव टू ड्रॉ इन क्लाइन लाइन सिंपली स्विच ऑफ द और थो कमांड सो इट इज लाइक दिस नाउ अगेन आई एम स्विचिंग ऑन द और थो मोड and uh, we'll take the iso circle command press i enter select this as center press f5 to change the plane on top plane one more circle is there for this the radius is 15 so in this way now here we have one rectangular slot which we can see in top view rectangular slot hai but this surface is inclined surface so that rectangular slot should be inclined only in the same manner so we will take the offset command here everyone listen carefully whenever we have inclined surface and on that inclined surface if we will have to draw anything simply select offset now from this side it is 20 from this side it is 20 because total width is 60 and uh, the width of the rectangle is 20 so dono sides are 20 20 chode ke so press 20 from the keyboard enter select line click here select line click here as we had done in uh, making the offset lines in orthographic and sectional orthography same we have to do again we will take this Now from this side it is 15. From this side it is 15. So we'll write 15. Select this line, click on this side. Select this line, click on this side. As well. Now we will trim the extra lines. Select these two as boundaries. Press Enter. These two boundaries enter. Then trim the line. In this way. Again, select trim command. Select this and this as boundary. Press Enter and delete the extra line. In this way. Now, one vertical edge from here it will be visible. Horizontal edge will not be visible because no horizontal edge is passing from this corner. So, no horizontal edge for the inclined edge will be visible. Only one vertical edge will be visible from here. So, we'll take this command. From here, we will draw one vertical line up to this in this way. So by switching off the construction line, you can see how it looks. So it looks like this, and we will have to take. We'll go to setting rectangular mode. We will start again. Go to multi-line text. Select this area. Right here, capital O. Select this capital O. From here, change the text type. Make the height to three. 
at trace of it. This is the circle. You can move the circle wherever you want. So this is the origin. They have to show that this is the direction for observer in this way. In this way, you will have to draw isometric projection. Understood this, everyone? How to take random line? Which random line I have taken? Sangram, message which random line I have taken? Others, please message. Have you understood the drawing? I have not taken any random line anywhere. These lines which I have drawn are just switch off the ortho and simply join the corners. And if you are asking about these lines, then I have drawn the offset lines, offset to this. यहाँ से इसका ऑफसेट है यहाँ से इसका ऑफसेट है विद द गिवन डायमेंशन यहाँ से इसका ऑफसेट यहाँ से इसका ऑफसेट और एक्स्ट्रा लाइन ट्रिम कर दिया मैंने इसका 20 और इसका यहाँ इसका ये डायमेंशन 20 दिया है ये टोटल 60 है तो मैंने यहाँ से 20 छोड़ा यहाँ से 20 छोड़ा और यहाँ से ये फिफ्टीन छोड़ने का दिया हुआ है यहाँ से भी फिफ्टीन छोड़ने का है तो ये थर्टी है तो ये डायमेंशन ऑलरेडी दिए हुए हैं उसके अकॉर्डिंगली ड्रॉ किए हुए सर्कल टू सर्कल यस ऑप्शन यू कैन यूज टू ड्रॉ पैरल लाइन वेट अ मिनट दे विल ड्रॉ द बॉक्स लेंथ कितना है 75 35 रेडियस है सेम ही सर्कल का तो 75 प्लस 5 80 80 प्लस 30 110 110 इज लेंथ maximum height is 100 and maximum width is diameter of semi circle that means 70 so start also on this side rectangular grid may have room right click settings isometric on this side i have calculated 110 I have calculated 100. This is again 110. This is 100. Place F5 on this side is 70. Enter. It is 110. Enter. Close. Update the line. 70. Enter. 10 so I have to delete this. From back side I will start drawing. Either say, either karna hai. It's a 75 length here. Mark 75. Enter. Back side mein pura 100 ka length hai. Height hai. So ye 100 ka height mark kar diya humne. Iske baad mein, I will be taking the construction lines. From here, place at 5. 270 enter. This is up to the height of 20. From here, Mark 
rectified radius. Finding the center, and this is seventy. And it is going from the center. Now at this top surface we have to draw curved area and at this bottom surface also we will have to draw curved area. So First, we will make the curved area for that with wire center also. In that point, say. the outline ellipse i enter like this as center change the plane radius is 35 35 pin select this as boundary gray center delete this now we will copy it copy select this enter Center base F5, we want parallel. When again it is showing the midpoint, then simply click this. We are getting it like this. Now take the line, when it is showing quadrant, then from quadrant to quadrant, we have to draw, draw this line. Now take the trim command, select this quadrant as your boundary line, place and enter, and select the bottom circle in this way. Now take the outline on here, on the back side how much is the length, 75, 50. and height, 20 meters, 180, and then polar on, So already 20 may ask you to enter, then polar on and join it in this one. Enter. Now the line command from here of on it is 70. This corner we will join with this. Off the on. So it is looking like this. Now this edge, this edge we will draw in this way. It is like this. Now here at this surface we have one cut. It is 60 degree inclined, so that we have to find the distance in rectangular snap. 
ओके टाइम इज ट्वेंटी एंटर पोलर ऑन इंक्लाइन लाइन फ्रॉम ऑन द साइड इट इज सिक्सटी Mark 60, 60, and we'll so that you can move from dimensioning to angle and press 60 now. Random length we are taking now. Same here on this side, press tab so that we can shift here. So, इधर से angle कितना हो जाएगा? 90. ट on this inclined surface first i will mark one offset line uh i think this offset distance is how much well mark 12 and select this line and here it is next step From center, this is the midpoint. From center, we will mark 17 on this side and 17 on this side. Mark the line. Take out the line only. Center. Mark on to on. Mark on. You can simply incline line. टोटल सेवेंटी उसमें से ट्वेंटी बीच का है तो ये ट्वेंटी फाइव एंटर रेक्टेंगुलर ग्रीड गॉन का साइड है ट्वेंटी पहले हम एक पॉलीगोन 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 साइड नंबर ऑफ साइड इज सिक्स एंटर एंड 
This way. <clears throat> First, draw the hexagon with side twenty. Then inscribe it inside the box. Then find the dimension of the box. From this corner to this corner. It is 40. उसरे साइड से भी मोस्टली 40 ही होना चाहिए. Then also we will check it. It's 35. 40 by 35. The box will be. Is it a regular answer? Okay. So take this light command. First, right click setting isometric snap. Okay. Take the line command. Now at this center only we have to draw. From this center, in the diagram you can see that horizontal edge is parallel to this side. This side. So this side, on this side, A should come and here corner will come. So box will be made. How will it be made? Like this. Forty should be on this side, and thirty-five should be on this side. There. The mark twenty. Enter. This direction, it's 17.5, and the it's F5. From this direction, it is 40. From here, it is uh, 35, and the then here 40, and the This is the box. This, 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 this. This is the box. On this box, or with respect to this box, we will have to draw. So, from here, the side is twenty. So, you have to cut mark here. Enter. As cut. फोलर ऑन लाइन So it is like this. नीचे की एजेस भी दिखेगी और तो ऑन. Its width is ten. So from here, ten enter. Let's get ten from here. Ten enter. Let's get. Offset it will work or not? I am just trying this. Yes. 
offset n and the When it will show different points or lines, don't select that. It will move to that only. And enter, select this line. Hello, hello. Again, if it is doing like this, then simply switch off O snap. And enter, select this line. So we will try copy, copy this line, base enter, base point, then start using that base point. We are taking this and from this. We have to copy this. In this way, we will get it. Now trim, select this boundary, enter, and select this line. It's kept. So it will look like this. Hello, we have kept. So I have also drawn it for the first time. Anything else which is visible here? No. So it is like this. Understood everyone? Message in the chat box, have you understood? Wait a minute, I am marking attendance. 